Hi everybody, Andy here with eTrailer.com. Let's take a brief look together at this B&B RV multi-purpose fuel hatch. Now this locking molded plastic hatch is going to give you exterior access for a fuel fill or port. The full coverage slanted back design. It is going to require you to drill a hole or holes for the fuel fill. And the hatch flange is going to secure to your exterior wall with the supplied screws that you see here. You're also going to get a small roll of butyl tape to seal that. And this is made here in the USA of UV stabilized plastic. So you're not going to have to worry about this fading or yellowing over time. And this is also going to do a great job of resisting road salt. And as you can see, this is in a polar white color. Just wanted to show you how this is going to lock just like that. So that's, that hatch is locked and then insert the key and turn it and that's going to allow you to open it. And the key is included with this. This is NSF, CSA, and TEI certified. And this does include everything that you see here. You're going to get this hatch door. You're going to get uh, the, the key with the lock, the mounting screws, and as I mentioned, the butyl tape very durable plastic construction. Let me go ahead and leave you with some dimensions. So let me retrieve my ruler here and measure the height and width. So as you can see from bottom to top, we're sitting right at nine and a half inches high, uh, tall rather. That's going to be the same for the width there. Just to confirm that with you, nine and a half inches wide. And then looking at the cutout dimensions, might be a little bit trickier uh, to show you here on camera, but looking at the, uh, the height there on that cutout, it looks like we're sitting pretty close to seat, uh, six and three quarters inches tall. And that's going to be the same for the width as well. Lining that up there. Yeah, so right at six and three quarters inches. And then the max, maximum depth here. Looks like we're sitting pretty close to three and a quarter inches on that. So hopefully that's enough uh, dimensions there to give you the confidence that this is going to work for you. Well, I think that's going to wrap up our brief look today. I do hope that all the information was helpful for you. Again, my name is Andy. Thank you for joining me.